Okay, and I realize I nearly forgot to put on the music. Wait a minute. The humans, let me go ahead and quickly get the music on. I nearly, I nearly forgot to put that on. Okay, so it should go on. It's a little loud. There we go. Okay, so good. It's live, it's live, it's live. Now, live stream, show up. No, you don't want to show up? Okay, then I'll force you to show up then. There we go. G'day, g'day, humans in the chat. How are you? So, uh, today we'll be building one big wheat farm. I started tilling things, but I realized water isn't essential. So I have to go ahead and quickly build us with water. Ah, this is gonna be fun, huh? It'll be a hell of a lot of counting. Chat, how are you? Y'all doing good? You're in online school right now? Then don't be in the stream. No. Go to school. Do your school. Do that. You have a better chance in that in that location than me. Go. This has real gills and how they breathe. They gills. They have gills for a reason, Cassidy. And plus, this is like a free second Google search. I have no idea why you're asking me. <laughs> Stretch Benton. That is. No idea if the measurements will go ahead and be completely correct. But the only thing I know, I have to go ahead and place a lot of water. A lot, a lot of water. Round 14. Ah. <laughs> ah, I don't care. You can do it if you want. I don't care. I just have a regular sword. I don't have any special. I don't care. Don't care about any of that right now. I'm not planning to go ahead and do any, get anything fancy, you know. Right now, I'm just planning to do whatever I can do. So I just have this here.
Teleporting seems kind of useless right now. I'm holding a bird. Then clean your hands. I'll be I'll be more concerned. Concerned what what that bird was having, you know. Well, that's big brain, hell yeah, bro. I'm pretty sure me jumping on this does nothing, which is thank God, thanks Hypixel, this does nothing. Kidding me, it's one block off from perfect. Should I? Should I chat? Should I go ahead and build one whole entire lane just to make it perfect? I really wanna now. Nah, not potatoes. It's wheat. We don't do the we don't do the potatoes here. Potatoes are for weaklings. Wheat is where it's at. And that's why I called Blade Techno Blade a weakling. The chat isn't tutoring me for shit. It's just you. That's how we do it here. We do we do wheat and wheat only. Bees is not in high pixel. Well, I'm not in high six right now. Now, what do you mean, bro? Wait, where's that, bro? I'm gonna go ahead and see if I still have. Wait, do I have that dirt one in my in my little e? Yes, I do. Good, 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 good. Yeah, bro. Wait, where's that? That's not point. That's not the point. The point is to have fun, bro. Ah! Are you kidding me? I can't do that. Before you let me place it, now you're not. You know I don't like. I don't like this game anymore. This is gonna irritate me for a long time. I mean, that's kind of the point. It's it's a joke. This over here is a meme. It's a meme. Don't take this seriously. If you do, you're big bad. Oh, wait. Oh, here's the easy part. I see the guy and follow the lines of the water. Oh. Grind simulator. I mean, yeah, I'm grinding the wheat, bro. So I am playing the game correctly. If it is a grind simulator, then yeah. I'm playing it correctly, bro. I'm grinding, grinding the wheat. This isn't just the farm wheat. I just want to farm wheat. It's a sort of... It's like one of those games where you just sort of do your own thing. Thing, you know, like a uh, choose your own... Choose your own thing, sort of... Just basically a choose whatever you want. Like, you focus on categories. Right now, I'm focusing on farming for wheat. Nothing else. Just wheat. I mean, right now I'm in a co-op, so the other people focus on whatever's up there. But right now I'm just over here chilling in my wait bro. What do you mean? I see more people grind bloody carrots and potatoes than wait.
And plus, I want to grind weight. I want to grind the weight game, bro. I don't care. At least it's more unique than those. Hee hee ha ha. Technoblade potatoes. Sadly, I have to go and add lighting due to all out up there, but I'll go and add the sea lanterns later. Weed is all you need in the game. Weed is life. Weed is love. G'day, g'day, ah, is she? Stream to chill, we, nah, bro. This is competitive, bro. We're, we're doing this on a competitive level. What do you do? What do you mean? Do you not see how much I'm sweating right now from the competitive gameplay? Like, right now, I'm surprised you guys have not, like, went off your seats, haven't went ahead and just all left the stream at once due to the competitive gameplay. Like, you, you see how intense this gameplay is right now? Like, this is so intense, bro. This is a whole time another level gameplay. Blade Ninja think he's good, bro. He's got nothing on me. Okay, should I turn off the shaders so I don't get this awkward blur? Blur of light. Or just shadow. And this thing over here from that. Should I? I'm not slash hubbing, bro. Yeah, I'm gonna turn off the shaders for that. I'm working on my I'm working on my farm, bro. The whole time point of this is I have a private farm, bro. I I don't. The whole time point of this is I have my own private farm. I don't care if it's better or not. Bruh. Again, I don't care. Can you not, please? Can you not? Can you not? Nice shader. Well, thank you. Sadly, I have to go ahead and put it, put it off. Excuse me. Really got to go ahead and uh. Wait, no, it's in collections. My bad. What do you mean, bro? I'm nearly at that hundred k already, bro. Like I'd be at that sixty nine thousand wheat, bro. The wheat game is easy, bro. I could easily go ahead and do that. You can buy stuff. That's what you do with the money. I didn't know if you know that, but yeah, you can buy stuff with the money. It's kind of intense, actually. Yeah? Why do you think I'm doing this? I'm doing this so I can get more wheat. Because the wheat at the hubs, when it comes to competitions, they are barely anything. Yeah, yeah. So, and can you please not call this tutoring banners because you're the only one doing, quote unquote, tutoring me. Even if you're telling me what to do and what not to do at this point. Can you? Can you not? Don't you think I already know this? Can you not? Can you not? Like I said, like 10,000 times. Can you not? Can you not? I'm 
serious, can you not? It gets annoying. You're you're ignoring me. Yeah, I'm saying, can you not? Can you not? Nothing harsh. So boom, there we go. Is it big enough? I mean, it's quite big. Bruh. If you're gonna go ahead and be like that, then don't even be in the stream. G'day, g'day, our 10,000 subscriber challenge. How are ya? Because, because you ain't doing it? Eh, I don't care. G'day, g'day, spider. How are ya? You doing good? I wish I could go ahead and do play select all the buckets at once and just shove them over there, but sadly I can't. I can't just go ahead and just double click like that. Otherwise, well, it'll just force it all the way back. Yeah, I'm doing pretty good. I'm just doing some wheat farming. sake of it. G'day, g'day, waiter. How are you? You doing good? father in fact this isn't even a stream it's a video it's a pre-recorded video of a pre of a quote-unquote chat over there which is just part of the video you just have this on full screen right now just watching a video boom I bet that blew your mind huh nice hell yeah Even watching a, you're not even watching a stream. You're just watching a pre-recorded video. How do you guys feel? Your entire life is a lie. You thought this was a stream, but no, it's just a video. It's just a video designed to go to trick you into watching it longer. It's just a long video, a very long video. It's a very, very long video. to watch? Why is it pain to watch? Why is it exactly uh, Cassidy? You're in Zoom call right now? Well then, cool. just pop out the stream, bro, and do your Zoom call. It'll be all fine, bro. And come back once you're done. You don't have to be here. It isn't a need. It's more of a want. And just something you do need to do is be in that Zoom call.
Help you build a pumpkin farm? No. I'm too busy with my weedy, working my we weedy boys, bro. No, I didn't kill Henry 2.0. It was my chicken, remember? Henry 2... Henry 2.0 went up to me, attacked me, my chicken pecked it to death. Well, it flopped on me and bit my leg and then my chicken pecked it to death. So you remember? Oh, wait, I forgot I could just do this. He didn't deserve it. And then why? No, it deserved it. The chicken defended me. The fish tried to kill me. It bit my leg because I had shrimp strapped around my leg. I always have shrimp strapped around my leg. leg just in case, you know. Just in case if you need some food. It was all self-defense, I swear. Very relatable. Exactly, bro. That's what we do on this channel. We sit down and talk about the relatable content. Such as the casual bloody uh, leg strap of shrimps. Yeah, my island is open to visitors. Of course, we have, you know, one singular role. If we're building something or doing whatever, don't disturb us. When I say don't serve us, I mean don't walk in front of us while we're building because it gets annoying. The only annoying thing is I have to go in and break all these torches that draw, draw Sage placed. After when I go ahead and place all the water. And then after that, I gotta go ahead and go back and forth on every single row. Slowly tealing everything. I mean, I got the 5x5 five five hoe. So that'll make the progress faster, but still. This is gonna take a while to do. Now you gotta go. Well then, see you later, you human. And have a good day. Come back. I mean, yeah, that's the goal. I'm gonna go all the way to the top, bro. I'm a competitive wheat farmer. On bloody PS4, bro, I got bored, so I went ahead and got myself in the top, in the top 20,000 for wheat farming, out of millions of people. NDR API is.
Nah. I don't have any of that stuff on. G'day, g'day, awesome. How are you? You doing good? Hopefully you guys enjoyed the very, very, very intense gameplay. Where I just sit down and slowly make myself a massive wheat farm for my competitive farming. Like in the stream, there's going to be at least one wheat event. Hopefully I'll be finished with this farm before then. And get someone, and get a friend to go ahead and give me a replenish book. As well, still have no idea how to get that. Since why well, I can't seem to get it by a chanting table. G'day, g'day, uh, R7 and Christian. How are ya? You doing good? Should I go ahead and craft more water? Should I go ahead and craft more buckets? I don't know, I don't have much inventory space and I need uh, quite a bit for these torches. Because I still don't want to waste them. Every time it's wrong and I don't care. G'day, g'day, Megan. How are ya? You doing good? How much we have I farmed? 69,000 so far. I know that isn't the most way in, in the entire game. But yeah, from just me farming casually within the hub area, I managed to farm myself 69,000 weight, which is still pretty nice. It doesn't really get a lot if you have these sort of wheat hoes. Which right now my my goal is to try to go ahead and get uh max turbo wheat. Because well I'm planning to go all the way out of wheat farming, right? Then I'm gonna go ahead and put the all these enchantments on another hoe of the uh, other maxed out uh wheat hoe. Of like the max max one, like the one that goes ahead and increases the amount of wheat you collect by collecting wheat. Like that one that costs like uh what was it like 10 million wheat altogether? Yeah, that's my goal in this. Just to get one of those. Just get one wheat hoe that costs 10 million wheat to get. 
I have one hoe for a that tills a five by five area. So when I till, it does a five by five area instead of just a one. And the other one is just for harvesting. I know I need a gold, gold medal. So why do you think I'm doing this? Gee, fair. That is fair. I can agree with that. I can agree with that. I can agree with that statement. Sure, indeed, human. Sure, indeed. Get a get a storm game on my my name is that cool. Yeah, there's a wait thing. It's right over here, I believe. Is that here in here? No. No, it would be in uh recipes there. I think it's Jacob's, right? Where was it again? Oh, of course it would be in wait. I'm trying to remember where it is at. Oh, harvest 50% wheat plus 3% farming experience. Harvest. How's it that? Is it that? Wait, let me check. Oh, never mind. It's this one I'm looking for. But to get this one, I believe you need one, one medal. What was it that? Actually, let me go ahead and slash hub. Wait, there you are. I think. No. Never mind. Here it is. It's even closer than I thought, huh? So I need to go ahead and get one mathematical hole, which is a half a stack of tickets and just one and just one golden medal. And as soon as I go ahead and do that, it allows me to go ahead and uh, recipes that allows me to go ahead and get this hoe, which I need surrounded with wheat with one mathematical hoe. Then after that, so. If my interface wasn't broken. Then it gets me this one. Which is you know slightly better. But you know meh. And then this one over here is the best one. Which this one is surrounded with a stack of. Stack of Jacob's tickets. And then a stack of enchanted hay bales on each one. Oh it's right here. And then you go to this one. Which these are tightly tied hay bales. Which need to surround it with. Let's see. Uh, stack. Two, two and a quarter of stacks of enchanted hay bales, which one of these is two and a quarter of stacks of regular hay bales, which, well, you know how to craft yourself hay bales. Dream of Mr. Beast, meh. Like, you know, Mr. Beast is a great human and all, but... Eh. Techno dream? Nah, bro. That copy and pasted. Mm. Okay, then. G'day, g'day there, uh, Fredham, how are ya? You doing good? After when I'm done with this wheat farming, I'm probably gonna go ahead and sit down and mine more, some more pieces of lapis.
Yeah, I'm doing good. I'm just sitting down. Farming... Well, making a wheat farm currently in Minecraft, you know? Sitting down, chilling. Can't find it. That be you. That be the big you. G'day, g'day there, nothing. How are you? You doing good? Thank God you don't lose hunger in this. Road to 23k? Nah, not really. That's been delayed by a lot since well recently. I've been getting negative in subscribers, which, you know, kind of sucks, but meh. I guess ha that's how YouTube be sometimes, you know. Isn't always a positive. Sometimes it leads to the negatives. Which, it sucks, but again, meh. Meh, meh. I need to get used to double clicking. At least double clicking uh tab for that. Alright, just in case if you're curious, my F5 shows this and my tab does this. So I switch both of them around just because well that's simply a lot more nicer for me. Since well, when it comes to me and PvP or whatever, or just any form of uh interaction against players I do it in third person normally or I just go ahead and randomly switch between first to third person so I can go ahead and just see my surroundings you know I wish I had that infinite water bucket I don't think we unlocked it. Pretty sure you get at the ice, the ice category, but I'm unsure. There we go. I deserve more? Nah, bro. I don't be a road to nothing right now. I'm just sitting down, chilling, just doing whatever, you know? Like, of course, it'll be nice to go ahead and grow. But meh, at this point, you know? Like, it was all about that growth life, you know? Like, those positive numbers, but... Eh, I don't know, I'm just chilling. Just some melons. Cool, cool, cool. You can make an infinite water source. What do you mean? You can have an infinite water bucket where basically you can go ahead and have a bucket that has infinite water in it. Which, you know, that would be useful right now. To make things a lot more faster. A lot less tedious, but I don't have that right now, so yeah. G'day, g'day, hitting cam. How are you? You doing good? On the road to 30 subs. Cool, cool, cool. That'd be cool, that'd be cool. I mean, sure, I mean, you've already joined the live stream. So, yeah, I guess you have joined, successfully joined, so... Congratulations, you human. But anyway, g'day, g'day there, uh... XDR Builder, how are you? You doing good? Not gonna lie, I like this stream. It's nice, chill, nothing crazy is going on. It's just me sitting down with the chat, farming, well, making a farm. It's 
knowing where you're at. Cool, cool, cool. I've never seen snow in my life since I live in Australia. But you know what? That just be that just be life. inches today. Cool. We don't do inches in Australia. So, yeah. We do the, uh, metric system that makes sense with everything else instead of just one singular thing. must be weird using that sort of metric system because I'm pretty sure there's like uh, 12 inches in a feet, right? And the feet is like... How much? What's, what's after? What's off? Well, one foot. How much feet does it take to go ahead and uh, go through that? Like how much would you need to go ahead and go for the next one? What's after that? Is it Does it just go straight to miles? I agree, like, I, I don't I don't care what anyone says. The only reason I'm saying that is because it's a lot more easier to add a zero than remembering different numbers. Like, you have to go from, uh, 12 to, uh, what's, what's, uh, what, actually, what's all the measurements over there they use over there in America? What's all the measurements? I know there's feet. There's uh, miles and there's inches. That's all I know from over there. Give, I'll give you a shout out. Well, thank you. I appreciate it, you human. Gonna play Uvu me in the chat. Isn't like one mile. Isn't one mile like two point something kilometers? So one mile was uh, 1.6 kilometers. One point six apparently. And by the way, I just googled it, so yee yee. But it's a very specific number, so if you want the full decimal, uh, one mile. One mile is uh, 1.609344 kilometers. I mean, it makes sense to some form of measurement. Like, I can somewhat understand it. I just... It's just a lot more easier going with meters, centimeters, and whatever, you know? Isn't it some... Isn't a yard a bigger... Bigger than a mile? Or is a yard smaller than a mile? Like, I have no idea, I don't use that metric system, but isn't a yard some full measurement? Okay, so how much yards are... How much yards are there in a mile? Yard is like three feet, okay then. Lot. Is there something that's above a yard? Like what ones? What's the one up from the yard? Like in over here, what we use is uh, millimeters, centimeters, meters, a kilometer, well, kilometer or kilometers. There's all that. But what's the one up from a yard? Miles. Is that it? What's on, 
What? Is there anything after Miles, or does it just end there? Ends there, you think? I think I was ended at kilometers, right? Actually, I'm curious. I want to check the uh, metric system versus uh, Imperial. Let's see. So, uh, the Imperial is inch, foot, yard, mile. Let's see, kilo, mega, giga, ter terra, okay then. Mm. Wait, is this the wrong one? Let's see, it is based off of length, grams, weight, or more, probably mass. Here's the difference. Metric. So it goes to, uh, me so it goes to milligrams, of course, to centimeters, no, not milligrams, sorry, Mill millimeters, centimeters, meters, kilometers. Is there anything else after kilometers? Or does it end at kilometers? I think, I, I, yeah, it just ends at kilometers. Hmm. That's interesting. I don't know, I find that weird. Like, wasn't there, wasn't there like a legitimately, like, at least somewhat good reason at the time of, you know, when America went ahead and said, hey, we want to be, we want to have this metric system instead. We want to go ahead and have just this, the Imperial system. Isn't there a reason for that? Like a really good reason? Well, thank you, Crunchy. I appreciate it. And you're cool as well. But wasn't there like a really good reason? Like, I remember hearing of it, but I don't know what it is. I forgot what it was. Uh, wasn't it for another reason? Uh... Why is that a imperial system? The British imperial system comes from the British Empire. What's the purpose? Because the British, of course. When the British Empire colonized North America hundreds of years ago, it brought it with it. The British imperial system, which itself tangled in the mass uh, supplies medieval way and measurements. So basically it was just a very It says here it that doesn't make any sense because it says here that it originate originated from, you know, the British Empire when they went ahead and pretty much went to North America. But it was I thought that had there has to be like a other legitimate reason, right? Like why they go ahead and use it outside of just uh, that, that sort of context. I guess that makes sense. But still. 
So by the looks of it, it is uh, a transition thing. So they went ahead. The British trans transferred to uh, a met to the obviously British Empire to America, and they kept the metric system, but they didn't change with the Brits, you know. But the Brits went ahead and changed the metric system. Which when did they do that? When did they change it? Wasn't it like 1700s? Yeah, it was around the 1700s when the British Empire officially changed it, but the people in America just decided to keep it the same. I guess they did it so they don't have to get confused. Which I guess that's fair enough. Changing an entire metric system all of a sudden for a already colonized area would be very, very difficult to work with. So that makes sense. I don't know. I feel like I'm digging way too deep for something so useless. <laughs> but you know what? What does it matter? It can just be like that sometimes. Some re measurements? Okay then. Talking about uh, the British and America, I remember there was this one person who used to troll on Amigle who was British. No, who was American. And anytime they find any form of Brit on there, they go ahead and ask them, what does, what's the price of The Sims 4 over there, right? And they say something like, I don't know, like 10 pounds or whatever. And the bloody American guy, the dumbass he is, would go ahead and ask this, why does your game weigh so much? It's like, bruh. <laughs> Ah, oh, th those troll videos are hilarious. <laughs> Making fun of the bloody currency, like bruh. G'day, g'day, Kagan. How are ya? Like we thought, cars weighed a lot. Wait till you see the blade cars in the UK, bro. They weigh a whole bunch. Yeah, bro. Like, I'm looking over here and the average price is £15,000, bro. That's a lot of weight on a car. That's a lot of weight from a UK car. <laughs> By the way, if you can't tell, I'm joking. Hmm. I don't know, it's just weird. Personally, when it comes to me over here in Australia, I don't think I've ever heard anyone use inch outside of the joking around about penises. Like, that's the only point in time where I'll go ahead and hear people use inch, kilometers, or the, that sort of system. Like, over here, we use the full-on, uh, just one, pretty much. The only point in time when we go ahead and switch around is when we're joking around, you know? Well, it's true. Like, you'll find those random teenagers, like, oh, oh, you got two-inch PP, you know? Get an infinite water bucket, that would be useless soon. Nah, we don't use miles, we use kilometers. Australia is like a different planet. I'm just gonna go ahead and let you know that'll surprise you. Not everyone in Australia calls Australia, Australia. That's like those people which is highly into like the slang culture. For me, I like, for me, I obviously go ahead and use the slang, right? Duh. 
but you know what? I don't use the entire thing. Like, I don't... I don't go ahead and use the entirety, entirety of it, you know, because I find some of them just weird. Like, personally, when it comes to me and the uh, slang over here, I don't use... I don't use the one that includes the words cunt. Like, there's, you know, mad cunt and all that. I personally don't use any of that. I do go ahead and just, you know, go up to someone and say, G'day, mate. How are you? I do do that, but I just don't use... I just go ahead... I don't go ahead and use words such as mad cunt or whatever. Which is an Australian slang. Which is weird. What are those group of people called again when they go ahead and just do that? Of course, there's a true blue Aussie. And bloody is also built in the slang casually for everyone. Which bloody basically means very... Like, that's bloody hard. That's very hard. That's... Everyone probably left just because I said that word, huh? Yep. Well then, sorry for saying... Sorry for do, being Australian. <laughs> uh, some person's probably gonna go ahead and yell at me, huh? I remember... I remember some random British teacher went to the school and they got so offended that we started calling her mate because she started calling all the students sexist because, well, apparently doing that sexist. But that's just a casual thing we do in Australia. Like, bruh. Can you play? I mean, you can go ahead and visit if you want. Like, bruh. <laughs> I mean, again, you know, sorry. Sorry if you're gonna go ahead and be a suck. Just no. How oh, cool, I just realized we. Our visit account increased by two. Sick. Oops. No. Bruh. Banner, sorry. Life lesson is love your nationality because Banner, sorry for being Australian, even though it's sarcastic. I'm just saying, when it comes to Australia, it's very weird and divided. Because everyone that quote unquote counts as Australian. Don't really fall underneath the category of Australian. Everyone else wants to fall under. Which I find that very bizarre. Like at this point in time. Australia is just a mess. Like I can't figure out what it is. Like we, we have like some form of general slang over here. But when it comes to the slang it's so divided. Like if you live in certain parts of Australia. You have different slang that people just don't use. Like, if you live in the western side of Australia, Australia, you use a different, sl different slang in comparison to us in the south, and we use a different slang in comparison to you. It's very weird. Like, if you live, like, all the way in the way back, you'll be, like, all the way true blue, you know? You'll use, like, all the above, while others, it's categorized. That's what I'm saying. When it comes when it comes to nationality, it's just it's very weird. Australia, I don't know. Australia's always been a weird country. Well, continent, island, whatever you want to say it is. I 
I don't want I don't want any of your money. I don't care. That would be boring if you just gave me money. If you don't play it, well then keep it. I don't care. I don't want it. But yeah, I don't know, Crunchy. I feel like that was a very, uh, what's the word? Oh, I know it was meant to be a kind hard thing, but that felt, that felt like a, oh, I'm, I'm offended how you went ahead and, you know, said that. Said that not all Australians say Straya. Like, sorry, it's just true. There's different slangs in different areas of Australia. Maybe they say it in your area. It doesn't mean that they say it in my area. But the one thing I can go ahead and say is just a natural culture thing that all Australia has is wonderful meat pies. Like, oh god, like, no matter where you go in Australia, bro, the meat pies stay exactly the same, and I love that. I mean, I'm not saying you offended me. I'm just saying the way you went ahead and typed that down kind of se seemed like you were offended. I'm just mentioning that in Australia, there's, when it comes to the culture, it's very divided. And it'll always be divided and be constantly changing due to the fact that Australia at this point in time is just a country where they go ahead and say hey everyone from the outside Come in and it slowly changes itself to suit those people that are coming in But you know what that's just Australia Which you know, it's nice to have a very uh I would say culturally open area But it does get a little weird Like over here like over here, they have like a whole entire section in my area dedicated to people who go with that. Uh, what what was that culture called again? That cult that culture where there was like that lady of like the several arms. There's like a golden sca statue with this like big, uh, fairly chubby lady with with arms, with like four or so arms or whatever. What was that culture called again? I don't know. Forgot what they called them. I know there's separate areas around here dedicated to those cultures anyway. Which I find that so bizarre to think. Like, you have to admit, that's a little weird. I don't know. When it comes to me in Australia and that, it's a very love hate thing like when it comes to the American and all that you can sort of generalize it of one thing right at least the culture of it of one thing love Australia you can sort of roughly do it but can't but that won't last forever due to how fast Australia changes but it'll also be as multicultural as possible which to be honest I I don't know I, I don't like that the most I don't think being completely multicultural and having like 17 different cultures within cultures within one area is weird. I think that's just a weird thing. Like, you know, that should I can understand there being like two or three. But trying to throw as much in as well. Just as much in as possible is weird. Is in Australia? Cool, cool, cool. I mean, I'm not surprised. Which, by the way, have you checked, like, the history of Australia, like, you know, the creation of the slang and why does it exist? If not, I recommend checking it out. It's very interesting. Very interesting, Lil R. Not read really documentary, but, yeah, it's still a very interesting watch. Just saying. Fair, fair, fair. I don't know. 
feel like I'm one of those people that can easily say whatever. That can offend everyone. You're from the USA? Okay. Cool, cool, cool. Hmm. I don't know. I mean, hey, at least in Australia, if I'm interested in another culture, I can most likely just walk to a different location. And I'll just sort of go ahead and, you know, find it there anyway. Just because, well, Australia's like, apparently wants to be the most multicultural thing. Which is pretty cool with my times. So I guess I don't have to go and do much traveling to explore different type of cultures. I don't know. I'm probably overthinking things again. I do that a lot. You're on your snap break right now? Cool, cool, cool. I need to go and get one of those risk pillows, you know? Like one of those uh, pillows you, you put in your mouse pad. Pad that you just lay your risk on. Because right now my risk is like hella red. Oh, it's a uh, techno dream. Country living, yeah, that's fair. I mean, that's cool. It doesn't matter. At by the end of the day, this whole entire thing will be one massive dog pile, you know. Like, no matter what you live, it won't, it won't matter. Because the whole entire thing will just die off. Like in Australia, we're losing our, our great coral reef. In America, they're probably... You, they're, why are they losing in America, actually? They're probably losing a lot more oil in comparison to us in Australia. So I know that's a big thing in America. Like what what's another what's something that America is losing? What? Well, yeah, I'm just talking about the long run, not the virus. That's a global thing, not just America. Power mines. Like what like there has to be something, right? In Australia, we're lose we're losing some of our. Uh... Yeah, but that's just a whole tight global thing. Just because you have it the worst, it doesn't mean you can go ahead and just you know prioritize your thing as you know. Oh, number one, number one. This is only our issue, you know. I know Australia has a te- no Australia, play America has a play shitty ass up. What, what's it called? Play. When it comes to the politics over there and all that, I know America is very shit at that. Like, they, don't they have like a two party system over there? Making homework to buy, see ya. Parents get vaccine, so you're happy. Sick. Hmm, I don't know. I, I'm a very weird person. Like, I, I have interest in a lot of things, and I have interest in a lot of weird things. Like, I hate the idea of politics, but yeah, I just find it just interesting, you know? Does this work? Yeah, that works. Good. I'm using this instead. Just so I can use the telekinesis. My parents won't let you. I mean, that's fine. You don't have to donate in the first place. It'd be all fine. 
G'day, g'day, Mocky. Want a VC later? Hell yeah, I will. Wait, that's assuming I'm not in school or not. I don't know. That's... Hmm. Am I the only one in... Am I the... O I feel like I'm the only streamer who... At least on the NSA, just doesn't care about majority things, but has an interest for it anyway. Like, I don't care, care about any form of American politics, but yeah, I find it interesting. I feel like I'm, I'm one of those people. Like, I don't care about Joe or whatever, but I find the whole entire system behind that somewhat interesting. No, I'm not. I don't have my. I have my trades off for a reason. Because I don't want to get our trader people. When it comes to me, when it comes to recording, I press star comma when it comes to recording. Mainly because, well, I don't know. I don't use, I don't really use that, uh, letter specifically. But, yeah. Well, carrot, I should say. Mostly just watch streams. That's fair. That's fair. I mean, I was. Al I mean, I. Well, I don't know. I'll be in it anytime in the future. At least massive in it. But currently, I'm already in an S&P, so there's no point in starting one. And I don't know. Then I, I might. I might join one as well. And again, I don't know. I'm planning to leave it since well. Let's just say I don't feel like the community within that area is for me, you know? Like, they go for, like, a completely different vibe in comparison to what I'm used to. Which I don't mind some of them, I just... I just don't think it's for me, personally. G'day, g'day, you humans of, uh, John's Games live stream. How are you? You doing good? Anyway, so g'day, g'day, Mochi. How are you? You doing good? Guy lost views. That's probably because he wasn't reading the chat. He was very, uh, he was, he was ignoring everyone. So that's probably why. My viewers love to talk, you know? I mean, that's why I built my channel off of sitting down talking to people. So if he doesn't talk, then my viewers will just simply leave. Like, he got his 10 viewers, he got a small boost, congrats, but you know? He just didn't do that one thing that my viewers really liked. And that's the, you know, good old talk. At least the viewers who was current who were currently watching. Those viewers don't find stuff like this interesting, which these are pretty much just a little talk and chill zone, you know. Alright. 
Yeah, I'm almost done. Right now, I'm just clearing the torches because all these torches were placed here because well, a lot of mobs are spawning. Which I don't have to worry about, thankfully. Because, well, all this area will be tilled. The only thing that will be annoying is placing sea lanterns along the roof. That sounds like a lot of shifting. Well, a lot of time shifting. Good luck, hell yeah, bro. Yeah, I remember you, Carlos. Don't worry. I have the dirt building wand. I got I got the little uh, dirt placing wand. But I don't have a building wand, nah. I feel like that would be more tedious about the flying. Like I built I place all this dirt by flying with using the uh cookie. Because I got the free uh four days of flying. Come on. Assuming if it works exactly the same, then yeah, I definitely want to fly after that. Like, it's possible to do it without, but still. Nah, I'm fine with getting it myself. I don't care. I don't, I don't, that's just boring. Like, you could go ahead and give us tips on things. Things like things we can do. Not should, of course. But we don't go ahead and accept gifts here. That's just a general thing we all agreed on. Just don't accept gifts. When I say we, I mean the people in the... Uh, currently the co-op, which is currently full. So, nah, you can't join, by the way. Because it'd be full. Nah, I can't PvP. great thing about this it it can do multiple farmland at once so that makes this slightly less tedious making it so if you go ahead and seal that one it'll go ahead make sure that oh the water blocked it off I'm not into PvP, so nah, I'm not good. I'm more of that sit down, chill and relax sort of guy, you know? Which is, that's why I'm doing this. I don't have to go ahead and do anything crazy. I don't have to pay crazy attention to it. I can just sort of lay back, talk to the chat and chill, you know? Which, that's why I don't stream Bed Wars. Just because, well, I'm not good at any form of PvP. I have to pay, like, really good attention. Like, I'm not that I'm not that bad at first-person shooters. At least I'm not the worst. Like, I can do them to some form of extent. The only thing that sucks about our first person shooters is I'm always in a disadvantage since I have since I averaged like a quarter of a second of a ping. Quarter second delay when it comes to that. So everyone can, you know, shoot me before I can even see them by a quarter of a second. Which that may not sound much. But that's a lot of time for a game. That's a lot of time for a game, you know. This is bad. Fair, fair, fair. I don't know. I like I like this. I like the atmosphere of these streams. I wish these streams would do better. Just the type that would just be sitting down, chilling, relaxing, nothing too complicated going on, and just well just vibing. You know, I wish these would do better. But you know, sadly, not everyone's into those type of streams.
sign for you. Cool, cool, cool. Uh, how do you make money? How do I make money and what? How are my hands not dead yet? I can play games for hours beyond hours. I sub to you. That's called sub to... That's called sub for sub, and that is against the YouTube terms of service. Like, you know, if you're a cool dude, I'll go ahead and sub to you. But I don't do any of that stuff, because, well, it's against the terms of service. Not me doing homework. Fair, fair. I don't really sweat. The only point in time I swear is when it comes with, uh, less, when it comes to sweaty hands, I don't know, what could make me sweat? I guess in a high, high paced game, you know, like if I'm doing like, uh, really, really like fast parkour, like speed running parkour, then my palms will sweat, but that's about it. Basically, I sweat whenever I focus. No idea what that is, but, uh, cool, I guess, eh? <laughs> the premiere, okay then. Gonna take a nap? Okay then. Well then, see you later, Castanine. Have a good day. What is the what in my country? test yeah but what type of test I don't I don't do I don't I don't do much when it comes with uh bloody things so probably not I don't know we'll ping you fair 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 It looks like I'm nearly done with the wheat farm. The only thing I have to do after this is place all the wheat, plant all the seeds, and after that I got replenished and I have nowhere, no I then I got nothing else to do. I only have those two things to do for now, so that's great. Got one person waiting, cool, cool, cool. Congratulations on that, John. Congratulations, indeed. Let's see here. Yeah, we're nearly done. We're like halfway through the ceiling. eating dinner but you keep on watching well then enjoy eating your dinner then you human after this i probably have to go ahead and start eating me food as well huh yeah i do
should I do this in two separate streams? I feel like I should do this two separate streams. One dedicated to just, you know, tilling and this. To the water bucket and tilling, which will be this one. And the next one will be dedicated to the seeds. Do you guys agree? Or disagree? I think that's not a bad idea, personally. I think it could work. I do do that, that means I could end this early and sit down and chill and eat earlier. But it also means I get less stream today. Which, how long has this been going for, actually? The stream's been going for nearly two hours. Which, you know, that's not the longest stream, but that's not a bad duration for a stream. I bet I didn't... I bet there's, there hasn't been much growth for the stream at whatsoever. In fact, I can go ahead and check that right now. Nope. And I was correct. Yeah, a lot of people don't find this stuff interesting. I don't know. I need to think of something else to go ahead and add onto this that will make it more interesting for you humans. Maybe just refresh the title, just chilling in high pixel sky block. Again, yeah, I feel like if I do that, then I'll get a lot more of those. Nah, nah, nah. You need to do this and that instead of this and that, kids, you know? Probably, I'll try that out next stream with a different thumbnail. Shall I try to go ahead and make something that looks somewhat good? Attempt to at least. I'm not very good at, I'm not very good since I'm not a very artsy person. Okay, I'm nearly done. I'm past halfway. That's cool. That's cool. That's cool. Yeah, I think I'll do it next stream because the seed place is going to take a what long time with a lot of back and forth. With a lot of back and forth. Thing. And I have to go ahead and get. I have to go ahead and collect a lot of wheat. Wheat, get the seeds. And do all that, you know? There'll be a lot of work with this. Which I think they'll take like two or three hours. Probably just to go ahead and, you know, get the amount of seeds and plant them. You got a like on it? That'd be sick, John. That'd be sick. That'd be sick. That'd be sick. I wouldn't be subscribed. I wouldn't be surprised if we weren't negative in subscribers from doing this. Or just negative in numbers. Because that's what's been happening for the last few days. I've just been going negatives, you know. Like, it may be not much, like, two or negative two or three. But still. That means there's no growth. That means it's, that means there's no growth. So that, be, so that do be sucking. But hey, you know, I guess what can you do? That's just life, you know? Sometimes you get the uh, best side of the apple, sometimes you get the worst, you know? Which, by the way, if you're wondering what I mean by that, one, how dare you not know why I mean, how dare you not know why I mean by that? I'm offended. 
I'm pretty sure that's a very clear one. So basically, you go out apple picking, right? And there's a chance that you can get a really, really good apple. Like, mmm, like the world's most juiciest apple. But there's also a chance that you just won't get a good apple. It will just go ahead and, you know, just completely ruin your prospective apples. Cool, cool, John. Cool, cool. Some delicious meatballs, all yummy. Cool, cool, John. That'd be cool. That'd be cool. I wonder what I'd have to do next. What would be my next? What would be my channel's next big thing? Should I evolve the content to something else to start doing that only? Probably. I should probably stream and just upload whatever does well. I'm gonna be honest, but I don't know. That just sounds boring. I like streaming. Streaming's fun, and Twitch is very annoying to deal with when it comes to their rules. Like, when it comes to the stuff I joke about, I'd instantly get banned off of Twitch. Like, for example, in this stream, I said the word out cunt like five times now, including the last time I said it. That would get me banned on Twitch so fast, bro. It's because Twitch has stupid rules. YouTube is a lot less, uh, it's a lot, no, it's a lot more lenient. And that's why, that's why I stream on YouTube, by the way, just because, well, it's a lot more lenient and, you know, <laughs> I can easily vibe on here. A lot more comparison to Twitch. There we go, last row. And there we go, now nah, I lost people because I said it. <sighs> I don't know. A lot of people are uh, sucks these days, so I don't know what to say, what to do about it. Our farmland. Here's a link. You you can't post the links in the chat. Mexico, Italian. Italy. No, Italy. My bad. Screen. What did you say? Italian. Italy, France. Bad. Anyway, so I'm going to go up there, and as soon as I get up there, I'm going to end, okay? The stream will end. The stream will be dead. What will I do? I'll end. As soon as I get up there, I'll go ahead and end the stream with a killer buoy. And you'll see what I mean.
Okay, so see you later, humans. Have a good day, mate. And again, mate, have a good day. And ka ba and.